Hey guys, it's Daniel with Hard Lens Media. Today, back with another perspective. Turns out Andrew Yang may have been onto something. As states keep and cities keep slowly, slowly, but steadily going. Maybe a UBI isn't such a bad idea in a com on a country with an economy that is unraveling in real time that we've given away our manufacturing jobs to. So Gary Indiana had something to say about it. Gary, Indiana is taking part in a pilot program that will give 125 people $500 a month for one year. It's called Guaranteed Basic Income. This program started in Stockton, California, and is funded entirely by private donations. Part I love that even in America, we're trying to do a UBI and we're like, you know what? The government, not even willing to try and put this money out. I mean, we spend that much in a minute on fuel for our jets. And I'm talking like UBI for everyone, but can't, that's not right. America can't be the ones to fund this themselves. It has to be funded with private business interests. Okay, I guess I'll take it because those people probably need the money more than I need to complain. Participants will be selected in a lottery. No one wants to be in poverty. Nobody, nobody want to be evicted. Nobody want to be homeless. They just need some help. All joking aside, this is really helpful. A lot of people are, you know, six, this is basically $6,000 a year. For people that are making $12,000 a year, people that are working full-time on minimum wage, this is an enormous boon. It's amazing. Just so little can help so many people. So what they're going to do is they're going to test this out. It's going to be rather effective for the people that it's involved with. And it's still going to be years before someone tries to do this in the big term. That's my prediction. Come back to this video in the future and tell me I'm wrong. I'd hope I am. This program is slated to begin next month. Now, last week, organizers shared a virtual presentation with the Chicago City Council. UBI is slowly moving through cities and uh, sort of getting to some states, but really cities. It's an idea the Andrew Yang put out, but as he put it, an idea that's not new for a long time, but now it's here. Now people are talking about it. I'm not sure how I feel about this moving faster than like state-based Medicare for all, but I'll take something positive. And people having a little more autonomy, people not being as afraid to leave their jobs because they have something backing them up, people not being afraid of uh, being left on the street because they can't pay their rent, anything that helps regular people live a slightly more comfortable life, allowing them to take time to study, to relax from working three jobs, is something worth talking about and it's something worth thinking about. So I'll let you guys in the comments that tell me, what do you think about a UBI or other derivative? What do you think about what they're doing in Gary? And how ironic is it that Gary, Indiana is doing this before someplace like Chicago? Well, let us know. See you next time.